Hey everyone, Tracy here. Thanks so much for tuning in to my channel. So today I wanted to come to you guys with a question that has been hitting my airwaves lately and that it is about combining locks. Should I or should I not? So if you guys are interested, please stay tuned. Okay, guys, so yeah, should I combine my locks? Um, have I ever thought about combining my locks? Um, actually, the answer to that is, would I do it if that's what I want to do? Yes, of course. It would be something that I would be game for to do if that was something that I wanted to do. Right now, I will tell you guys that no, that is not something that I want to do. Is it something that I would do in the near future? If I feel that it is going to be something that benefits me at that time, then yes, it will. But right now, I would say that no, because pretty much when I decided to go with the parts that I got in my hair right now, I was satisfied with the sizes that they are. I didn't really feel that I needed to combine any locks. Now, there might be a few that I would say I would com wouldn't mind combining because either the parting is so small and maybe that lock won't... Um, and let's just say that lock won't survive, you know, the uh, the muscle or bustle of being locked. So, like, right back here would be, let me see if I can turn around and show you guys um, what it is I'm talking about. Hold on one minute. Okay, like, all right. Right back here, this right here, I would definitely look at maybe combining in the future because of how small that it really is. The parting is so little. And then besides that... They have somewhat like combined themselves. I, somehow I'll end up interlocking it together some kind of way anyway. So I just might just go ahead and let it just do what it do. And I just won't even um, bother with taking it apart because I'm just going to let it go ahead on and combine together. But other than that, you know, it'd be like little ones like that or maybe some on the side that I feel that wouldn't make it as a lock by itself and needed to be combined but other than that just to make my locks bigger than what they are i'm not going to say that it wouldn't be something that i wouldn't do I, it's just right now it's just something i like my hair the way it is and i'm just going to keep it and continue to do it um if i decide to do it yes i will come and show you a video of what it is that i'm doing and how i'm doing it because i'm finding out now you know since we have been through this pandemic it's a lot of people that has sister locks and they're not able to go to their consultants anymore, you know, right now at the moment and get their hair done. And it's kind of like left up to them, you know, to wonder and figure out what it is that they're going to do with their hair. And so it's quite a few videos of young ladies that I'm seeing who is starting to combine their sister locks. And I'm like, wow, you know, because to a point it's kind of sad because what if they really didn't want to do that? But then again, you know, you didn't have no other choice. So I'm going to go ahead and continue to follow these young ladies and see what their journey is all about because that is something interesting because if it's something that I choose to do in the future, then um, I will have their, you know, their story to tell or their story to go back on and see how they're doing it to be able to do it as far as my own hair. But yeah, you know, I have been seeing there's quite a few people that have sister locks and that is what they are looking at doing is combining those locks together and being able, you know, so that they can be able to take to take care of those locks because with those sister locks, they do they are small and really you do need someone with that can look over your head to really know what they're doing because when you're trying to do them locks like that yourself, you will join them up together anyways to some point. So I guess, you know, they, you know, it's a person got to do what you got to do. You know, that was one of the reasons why I didn't want mine that small is because of that. Because I knew that I wasn't able to afford having a consultant or someone to be able to take care of my locks for me. And I had to do them myself. So... 
Yeah, but like Tafari is combining your locks. Hey, if that makes you, if that makes it easier for you to take care of, I see nothing wrong with it. I did want to just come in and just you know to share my opinion because I did had a few people to ask me, you know, have I thought about doing that to my hair? And you know, right now, no. But hey, if it's what makes it you know works for you, then by all means do it. You know, um, just I would say. Uh, you know, try to find someone who knows what they're who knows what they're doing, and maybe follow their journey, and be able to watch their videos, so they can show you exactly how that thing goes. Because I really wouldn't know myself to even really just demonstrate for you. But if I was to just to combine some locks, it would be these two in the back to some point. And I really don't think it's really that hard to do. It's really just connecting them two together. But what I'm going to do is watch these two locks over the, you know, over the over time and see just really what's going to happen with them before I just officially decide to um, combine them. But yeah, guys, I just wanted to come in and share that little bit of information with you guys. But yeah, um, I thank you all so, so very much for sticking by me, sticking with me through this difficult time. I'm in and out doing this, doing that, and I just ain't been you know, making videos like I usually do. Um, I do want to apologize for that. But guys, if it's anything that you uh, that you want to know about or anything like that, please do not hesitate to leave a message under the videos or message me on Instagram. Please go ahead, follow me on Instagram because there I do be able to answer more better than I do here on YouTube. If I don't see the uh, comment or the question in the comment sections of the videos it's kind of hard the way they are changing things around here on youtube so much but yeah if you follow me on instagram you are able to get a more quicker and faster response from me because it's direct you know when you send it i get it okay so but i do want to thank all of my new subscribers i see you guys how are you guys doing Drop me a note in the comment section and let me know how your girl is doing. And um, if there's anything you guys want to know or or anything that you guys want to see me do on here on my channel, go ahead and leave it in the comment section or message me on Instagram as well. Let me know that you're following me. And I want to thank all of my old Ride or Die subscribers. I know you guys, hey, you know y'all right, you know, I see you, I see you. And I want to just say thank you so much for your support. So with that being said, guys, I want to wish you all well and just stay safe and grounded. You know, that's mainly the main, the biggest thing I really can say at this time because it is so much that's happening and going on so quick and fast that sometimes we can just lose ourselves, our thoughts, our training. But try to keep it together, guys, because we need this up here. You know, without that, I don't know what we're going to do. All right? So, yeah. Um, so if you guys, um, this is you are new to my channel, checking me out, go ahead, hit that subscribe button and ring that bell so you can be stay in touch with me as well as being notified when I do upload a video. I wanted to come in and just wish you all well and to get that question out there for you guys, hey, do anything that you feel is going to help you in your lock journey or any journey that you decide to do. Don't just sit back and just wonder, wonder, wonder. It's good that you ask questions, and I will say yes. If you feel that um, combining your locks is going to work for you, then by all means do it. By all means do it. Just, you know, uh, and let me know how it's working for you. <laughs> so, yeah, with that being said, I want to wish you all well. So, until the next, be safe and be blessed. So, bye.